This is the scent. The culprit is here. But how do I draw him out? I've got it. If I disguise myself as Seabreeze and win the race, maybe he'll come to me. But how am I going to manage to beat those other dogs? What a good-looking question. And I think I might have a sexually compatible answer. Pills? Look, I don't want to host a right-wing radio talk show. <laughs> and mega dittos to you, sir. Just slip these pills into the dog's food, and you can have sex with them while they're unconscious. Actually, I just want to win the race. Well, whatever you're into. Ah, crap. And they're off. Out in front, it's Seinfeld, followed closely by the British office, followed by anything with John Stewart in it except Death of Gucci. Back in the pack, it's Becker, but now Becker's stumbling badly. Becker is fading. Becker's being passed by reruns of Night Court and that infomercial with the Chinese guy selling real estate. Trailing them all. That's not Seabreeze. That's Brian. Arrest that dog. I'm not the father of Seabreeze's puppies, Joe. I'm innocent. Sentimental hogwash. But the real father is right here with us. And he is none other than Glenn Quagmire. What? Still less hair than a Greek chick. Quagmire, huh? Wow, I kind of thought it was going to be that billionaire. You know, the guy that used to own that cable news station and was married to that 80s worked out queen. She hasn't really worked in a while. Kind of long in the tooth. Well, she did have that one movie with that actress with the fat ass. Are you trying to get us sued? 